Tonight at 6, a family is grieving the death of an 18-year-old woman. Tonight, IMPD is telling us that Ariel Calhoun was shot to death last night on the northeast side of Indy. And our Chase Howell spoke with her family about what they believe led to her death. Her family tells me they're confused on what happened. All they know is they heard the gunshots from their home less than half a mile away. With tears in their eyes and heads hung low, balloons were released in honor of 18-year-old Ariel Calhoun. I never thought that I would be getting ready to cremate my daughter. IMPD says Calhoun was shot and killed Sunday night on Scarborough Boulevard in Crest Lane, just a few blocks away from where she lived with her mom, Crystal Connor. For me to hear gunshots, and I know my baby went to the gas station, then something just didn't sit right. I felt something in my gut saying something just not right. They got to be aerial or something. I don't understand because I felt it in my spirit like it's just something wrong. Connor says she rushed to the scene and would later learn her daughter was the one killed. My baby was being chased and she was running home to me and she did not make it because they shot her before she could come on this next block to get home to me. She was running to me and Ariel didn't deserve to be shot down or anything. As for justice and Calhoun's death, her mom says that's not up to her. I just hope whoever it bothers them so bad, maybe they turn they self in. I don't know, you know, maybe them taking my daughter, you know, change their life. I don't know, you know, it, it's just hurtful. It's all just hurtful. Calhoun's mother says her daughter graduated early at just 16 years old and loved working on cars. As for the person responsible for shooting and killing Calhoun, that's under investigation. Reporting in Indianapolis, Chase Howell, 13 News.